What's up everybody, how you guys doing and welcome back to another video. So today's topic is if 1 trillion buckets of water would simultaneously be emptied onto the sun. Okay, so let's assume a bucket has 10 liters of volume. And no, I am not going to give you gallons. You can convert. With 10 trillion liters of water, we have 10 billion cubic meters or 10 cubic kilometers. According to NOAA, there are 332,519,000 cubic miles of water on Earth. And one cubic mile is 4.16818 cubic kilometers, which means that on Earth there are approximately 1,385,999,045 cubic kilometers of water. You basically empty a fraction of 1 over 138,599,905 of Earth's water onto the Sun. And the Sun is approximately 109 times as large as earth what we are talking about is a tiny drop of water on a gigantic surface it would evaporate instantly and that was it it would not even matter if you took 10 trillion or 100 trillion buckets the result would be the exact same and no matter how much water you used it's impossible to put out the sun that way the energy from the sun is not produced by a combustion that needs oxygen and could therefore be put out by removing oxygen from the reaction the energy from the sun is produced by a nuclear fusion reaction that only needs hydrogen and gravity. No oxygen requirements for the reaction, no fire extinction with water. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are a new watcher. And I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Peace.